A question of character. character. Pac-Man is a creature of insatiable hunger. A chomping yellow disembodied head. Pac-Man rolls about, his mouth constantly opening and closing, munching upon anything that is in his way. Pac-Man does not have teeth. Anything meeting Pac-Man's oral orifice is met with pulverizing pressure. With gaudy consumption, Pac-Man noisily chews with garish sounds of a waka 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 or Paka 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 sound. Pac-Man take no consideration into others while dying. Pac-Man is rolled into a haunted maze. It is haunted by four ghost monsters. These ghosts are not spirits of former living creatures. No. They are ghost monsters. Ethereal beings that inhabit the maze, haunting any creature that dare enter. They give chase to Pac-Man's reckless trespassing. The ghost monsters have names. Shadow, Blinky, Speedy, Pinky, Bashful, Inky, and Pokey. Clyde. When they were providing nicknames, Clyde came late. It is imperative that Pac-Man outwit the ghost monsters. And he will outwit them. Twisting, turning, munching. Until he can finally turn the tables upon eating the power pellet. A revitalized Pac-Man will gain the courage and true metal to face the ghost monsters. They will wash of their vibrant colors. The ghost monsters will convert into blue cowards with frazzled, distressed faces. Pac-Man's hunger will grow. Give chase. The ghost monsters have become prisoners in their own maze. Pac-Man will devour their ectoplasmic frame chewing their entire essence leaving only the eyes and in a ghastly macabre instance the ghost monster's eyeballs fly through the maze in retreat back to their home base to be reskinned the eyes are placed into hollowed out sockets and the ghost monster is again reborn but Pac-Man must avoid the ghost monsters. A simple touch will lead to a gruesome death. Pac-Man's mouth will be painfully retracted beyond its normal threshold. It will wind until his entire exterior begins to disappear. Then Pac-Man will explode into veritable fireworks of yellow flesh. Oh, the scene is odious. Pac-Man will use the secrets of the maze. He will transport, shrugging off commonly known Pac physics, appearing beyond himself or returning. Pac-Man will fool the ghost monsters into ripping their ectoplasmic flesh, displaying their pinkish internal ghost monster organs. Disgusting! Pac-Man disturbs the ghost monster's maze over and over, constantly consuming the pellets they feverishly guard. However, upon the 256th time, Pac-Man will inadvertently destroy their home. The terrain will be altered into a mod of colored letters and numbers. While seeing their home permanently destroyed, the ghost monsters will peer in amazement. Tagman will continue on, unfazed from his destructive behavior. It begs the question, who is the true monster? Pac-Man? or the ghost monsters? Obviously, the answer is the ghost monster. The word monster is in their name, but Pac-Man is a close second because only a monster would steal fruit from another's home. Oh, you free-spirited glutton. Next episode. Well, excuse the f out of me. Quest with me. Learn with us. Enrich your mind. Empower your anchor like our material. Subscribe to our page. Put character into quest. Return every Monday for more. A question of character. character. character.